They say that doctors make the worst patients, always second-guessing the doctor, telling them how to do their jobs. Unfortunately, medical students, with their vast array of clinical experience and medical knowledge, are most guilty of this. Oh, hello there. Come on in and take a seat. Now, it says here that you're new to the practice. Is that right? Yes, that's right. I've recently moved here for university. How lovely. Is that Brighton University? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> okay. And Sussex. <laughs> yes, that's unusual. How come? Well, for my course, you're actually part of both universities. <laughs> oh. So why are you... Yeah, so because I'm here for five years, I thought it would be best <laughs> to set up with a new general practitioner. Oh, five years? You're doing medicine? <laughs> well, yes, I don't like to mention it. But <laughs> since you asked, yes, I am studying medicine. Lovely. <laughs> oh, that's at Brighton and Sussex Medical School. Yeah, I prefer to call it Sussex and Brighton Medical School. <laughs> anyway, moving on. What brings you to the practice today? Well, I've just been feeling really breathless at the moment. And we were doing respiratory exams on each other the other day, and my friend said she felt a lump. And uh, I'm just feeling really tired. Like, I just want to sleep all the time. So, what exactly are you concerned about? I am sorry. I don't actually think you were meant to speak then. I haven't had my golden minute yet. <laughs> Why would you not do 
NHS expert. It's asbestosis could have bred by now. Fair enough. Fair enough. Right, well, um, do you have a cough at the moment? Yes, yes I do. <coughs> I see. Right, well. Listen, I think you're suffering from a condition known as complex, unfounded, nervous tendencies. You're fine. So just calm <laughs> down. Oh look, here's a leaflet. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> We're struggling to get enough halls for the 18-year-old mums.